There are two ways to share boards and collaborate in Milanote. You can invite others to edit your board, or you can share a read-only link to the board, and it's all done under the share menu in the top right of a board. First, we'll invite someone to edit our board. This is for when you want a teammate or a client to be able to add or edit anything, just like you can. Just add their email address here, and they'll get an email with a link to edit the board. Or, if you want to invite a group of editors at once, enable the Invite Editors link, copy the link, then share it via email or a messaging app like Slack or Teams. When others start editing the board, you'll be notified in Milanote and via email, so you don't miss a thing. If you're editing the board together, you'll see their changes in real time, which is great for brainstorming or group workshops. It's worth noting that anyone you add as an editor will need a free Milanote account to edit the board. The second way to share a board is with a read-only link. It's perfect for when you want to present your work to a client or share a board with someone who doesn't use Milanote. They can view and comment, but can't edit the board. First, turn on the read-only link, then set the viewing options you need. You can allow people to comment, which is a great way to get feedback on your work. They can create a free Milanote account to add comments, but they don't need an account to view the board. You can also write a welcome message to appear the first time they view the board and set a password for those top secret projects. When you're happy with the viewing options, just copy the link and share it. When they click the link, they'll see a read-only view of the board without all the editing tools. If you enable comments, they'll be able to add specific feedback and mark up your board. And that's a quick look at how to share boards in Milanote.